Setting up for tomorrow's medieval festival. This place will be packed tomorrow. So we'll uh, get some footage tomorrow of things happening. Jousting and swords and arrows and all that fun stuff. This is going to be the merchant alley. Everybody's going to set up their tents, and sell their stuff. This will be where the feast is tomorrow evening. It's always fantastic. This will be, the event happens only every two years, but I guess this will be like, what, our sixth time? I'm going something like that, I think. One time they had it in the grotto because it rained. It's actually pretty cool. I liked it. It was fun. And I'll be doing the archery with some volunteers from the uh, Archery Association of Manitoba and the pole art, Robin Hood pole archers will set up one spot in here shooting into there. I'm going to clean all that out though. And then another some more shooting stuff just outside here. So we'll just kind of shoot towards the wall. Just waiting for the other archers to get here. But, yeah. Let's go for a walk up. Let's go for a walk through first. So tomorrow's festival is all by the church, for the church. It's all fundraiser. Everything goes uh, towards the church to maintain this place. Uh, it was built in the 30s, or started in the 30s. It takes a lot to upkeep. As you can tell, it's not real rock, but it's uh, concrete, so it's a lot of maintenance, as you can see. It's crap. So yeah, the last festival, not the last one, but the one before that, all the tables were in a row here. Everybody, all the way around, it was, it was actually kind of fun. I don't know, it was uh, different, but enjoyable. So, uh, I guess, what do they call all this? Stations of the Cross, I guess. Um, I am Christian. I'm denominational and just Christian, not Catholic. This is Ukrainian Catholic, not Roman Catholic, so there's a difference. But uh, I do volunteer here for the festival because I like to geek out and stuff. So let's go up. in the floor. You can go out further yet. It's always a good spot to watch the jousting. Right here, best seats in the house. Jousters come from all over the place. I don't know about this year, but uh, where they're all coming from, but still some from Europe and America and I think Australia. And, uh, previous years we lit fireworks off here. This year, Fire Chief won't let us. Boo. But uh, yeah, so 
There's no fireworks this year. Adjusters, I don't know, I was talking with one of them one time from Europe. And I mean, they joust in front of castles that are like, you know, literally from the medieval ages. But he said they really like it here because even though they're in front of castles, you know, from a thousand years ago, there's, you know, all sorts of high rise buildings or, you know, modern age all around it. They come here and it's like you see this in the grotto. And, you know, so it's just in, I don't know, he's, he said the feel of, of the festival here is, is uh, just different. And, yeah, so Saturday is sold out. And if anyone sees this, Sunday still has lots of uh, tickets available, but uh, they probably will go fast. So last time there was, I think, over 7,000 people here. So this time they're hoping for the same thing, but it's the first one. Since all the government lockdowns and all the government BS over COVID. But, uh, let's see you there.